Good day and welcome back everybody. Unfortunately, we got some of this white shit all around our yard. It has been causing some road havoc, of course, uh, on the highways. Everyone seems like they don't know how to drive first thing as soon as that snow flies. But uh, we've got uh, almost all of our wood sold out here actually, guys. It is October 26th here today. We got a little pile right back there. And we also got this pile right right back behind me here. We all a cord loaded up right now. We just pulled that off of that pile right there. This is just going down the roadway. For a contest, it is going to be coming up soon here, guys. We are, it's either going to be October 26th or October 27th. One of the two days here, we are going to see exactly how much wood we take out of this here. We still got another order, possibly another two orders coming in here. Uh... The one order is kind of the one that's kind of uh, this, the next half cord that we're going to be taking out here. Kind of judged who the contest winner was just because we gave them, uh, we had two orders. We had a quarter cord going out tomorrow, Friday, and a uh, half cord today going out here. And we offered him, well, we first offered him today if he wanted it. And then uh, we offered him because then the quarter cord sale came in right after. So we offered him maybe possibly even Friday. He chose Thursday. So uh, it might be the 26th here. We're going to see how much we take out of this next pile here and if any more wood orders come in here. So we're looking at either 26th or the 27th roughly to sell out all this wood. So uh, for the contest winner, we are going to be revealing that probably on our next video, which is going to be coming out here on Saturday. It is Thursday right now. So we will catch you guys in a couple more days. But uh, in today's video, it's uh, kind of a bounce around video. It's of uh, this one tree job that I've been working on for a little bit taking me a bit of time I unfortunately well I didn't even plan to get any really video footage of this job just because for most of it I was a one-man team and I just want to kind of get in and out of there because he's doing some construction and he wants to rip up the back side of his house so we're just trying to it was just a bit of a time crunch on this uh, job here but uh, we got it all done I kind of jumped in and out don't really got much tree job work uh, tree work actually in this video this kind of video is more just for uh, personal reference for myself or business wise down the future. Uh, I'm sorry, sorry for all you guys. We can cut and cut out all the good action and just kind of showed you before and after and what all kind of got happened at this job site. We'll catch you guys in a little bit though. Good day and welcome back everybody. We are on a job site here in the city. Uh, not going to be, I uh, didn't get too much footage on this video. Just want to kind of give you guys, uh, I just want to include this in the video. More for my personal reference for down the road. And uh, just I want to get this little bit of footage in here before, uh, I guess before I'm done the job. But uh, it's been a pretty big job here. A lot of clean up. Uh, turn you guys around and let you guys see what's going on though. All right, so we're at a, somebody bought this place. They're fixing it all up. Here, we had a pretty big tree. I'll probably throw up a photo. Hopefully I got one. But that was this tree here. It was all tangled up into these wires on this side. We got that half down there yesterday. And then we had this, uh, ooh, I think, I forget the name of it. Some kind of poplar tree or uh, one of those guys. But we had this guy all tangled up in all these wires so we got him all taken out there nice and slowly we are got to uh, take him out this little guy out and then we got one two three the third one down there kind of breaks off into three stems that go up there and then we got this big tall spruce tree which uh, we're not going to be able to climb this one unfortunately at least not to the top just because we've got those power lines up there. Those are the main power lines. If the tree is 10 feet or closer, they have to come in. Uh, we have to get the power line people come in and they pretty much uh, take it 10 feet underneath that. They'll pretty much take it down to these connection lines right here. But uh, they're gonna be coming in here. That's completely free. I'm in there, that's pretty much uh, their job. 
they don't will they won't come in there unless it needs to be done but since uh the cust this uh property wants it to to remove it they'll come in there take it at a safe uh safe working height and then i'll come in here and finish it off but uh we got that tree we got this guy right here boom boom these two ugly ones and then coming out to the front here we had a bit of a fir bush or a, a cedar bush right here there's the roots from it we got one two three four and five this whole area was just covered in all these uh that little cedar bush so we got that all cleared out there we had a big tall bushy spruce tree right here as you guys seen that we'll pop up a photo of just the front end here and then we got this guy right here i was going to get him finished off yesterday but uh, a little bit of difficulties with my little hand saw but we got to get him down today and then the very end we got to come back here and do all the stump grinding get that all all the stumps in here so all ground down and uh yeah it's gonna be a pretty big job but we're gonna try to get most of these trees down and, except the ones that the utility guys got to come in here to get done pretty much everything else try to get done here today and uh then we only have to come back later on with do some stump grinding but uh i'm probably not probably not going to get too much video footage on here i don't got too much of a hand on this job but uh, I just want to give you a little reference before, before, kind of a little bit before and after. Catch you guys in a bit though. And there we go guys, we're pretty much finished up here. It's a bit of a later night here, but we got this guy down, all lowered up in the trailer. We got, uh, like I said, those cedar bushes all taken out. This guy's down, that is not sawdust, that's all rock. Coming into the back here. Bit of a long fucking day, but we got that one down, that one down. You guys already seen that guy. We finished up this guy and we got that corner one done. And then just this little bit right here. Definitely opens it up quite a bit in here. He might be calling us for this guy couple of these small ones right here uh we're getting like i said the power company and max to come in to deal with most of this guy and then we just got an ash tree, ash tree with three sprouts just at the very back there we got to get down that might be our job where he's gonna he might take that over himself we'll have to see but uh we got the main ones down that he wanted finish cleaning up here although we got a little bit at the very back, we gotta get tidied up. But we're gonna swing to the back there, get that finished up, and we're done out of here. Have a good day, guys. All right, so we're back in the yard here, guys. We got uh, last time those guys down, this one, and these guys over here. Got called back, and Max finally came out, top take off, took off the top on that guy, and then just the two on that one uh, stemming off right there, the ash tree. So we gotta just pretty much clean up this guy, that one, one, two, three, four, five, and then just our pine tree here, which should be pretty easy. We're, we're gonna get, and uh, probably come back here next week to do a bunch of stump grinding. We gotta, it's gonna be a good full day worth of stump grinding out here though. Coming into his backyard though here, we got that stump ground down, another stump ground down there. There's another one right there. The one just out front of the here, we had the main tree that was all caught up into these lines here that we got tangled out. One tree right here, another one just at the back, and then we had another one over here, another one over here, then we had that big uh, ash tree right here that split it off to three. A little stump back there, a little stump back there. We had that big pine tree that was sitting, standing here in our backyard. It's all cut down. Another stump, little grinding right here. These are all the, just the end little pieces here. We're putting them in the green bin to let them uh, just recycle in the city here. But the yard looks pretty good.
pretty bare mostly, but definitely big job. We it has been I think a little over a week. We had uh two days, three days, maybe with a hand. But uh it was actually pretty good. Take it over to the front. Uh I'm gonna show you some before and after pictures. Either I already showed them to you or we're gonna be showing them to you guys just in a little bit here. This place was a mess, it was a bit of a jungle. But uh, I'm going to get a couple pictures uh, snapped up here just before we head out to the front. Just for our client. Meet you guys up front there. Alright, so making our way to the front here. We did our, uh, just the two big uh, stumps. The one that we're going to have in the video is over there. We had another big one right here. But uh, it turned out pretty nice. Oh, also we had all those little shrubs that we had to get uh, grinded out just out the very front there. But we got Lance here just uh, doing a quick cleanup. We're gonna get uh, the old Barrett stump grinder loaded up, return. Uh, we actually got a wood order, as you guys can see. Taking that out here next. But that was our video, guys. Like I said, uh, I didn't really show any too much tree action in this job. I kind of just showed before and after. Uh, we got a stump, bunch of stump grinding that we're gonna be, well, we got one big stump grinding that we're gonna be showing you guys in another video, what we, which we did on this property. But uh, like I said, this is more for personal reference, just for myself or down the way, and uh, just for anybody else, for my business-wise, the tree side, if I need to refer anybody to show the kind of work I did, I kind of got this on YouTube here. But uh, we will catch you guys again, like I said, on Saturday with our new contest winner. Thanks for tuning into Arms High Life. Bye, guys.